Hello everybody, this is Gary. Today is Monday, June 24th, 2019. It is 11.08 a.m. in Rochester, New York. This is my coping with schizophrenia update for today. Um, I'm on a fixed income. I'm on social security disability for my schizophrenia. And at times money runs short and therefore my grocery shopping runs short of all the food that I need. So today I went to a local Third Presbyterian Church for free food. They give out three or four bags of groceries once a month. And the reason I bring this up is because a lot of people who are mentally ill on disability have a limited fixed income the same way retired people do. Um, I do do part-time work for extra money, but sometimes even that's not enough. So. Um, most major cities and even small towns have some sort of church-run food bank or food cupboard, um, whatever you want to call it, where they give out free food, usually no more than once a month because the resources are limited. Um, I actually haven't picked up any food from this church in three or four months because I really haven't had the need to. But this month, my bills were higher than normal. And I ran out of money. I think I have like 60 bucks left in my checking account. And I'm trying to make sure that I don't overdraw my bank account, which I have been doing far too often, which actually costs even more money. If I take money out of my savings or checking account and overdraw it, say I take out $40, well, they're going to not only ask for that $40 back when I get paid, but an extra $35 is a penalty for overdrafting my account in the first place. So I wanted to stop doing that. And one of the ways of doing that is trying to find out which churches in your local area help give out free food. I'm in Rochester, New York. There's actually several churches that do this or provide hot meals like breakfast in the mor morning, five days a week, or the local Catholic church, um, Blessed Sacrament, offers dinner five nights out of seven days. Monday through Friday, they provide free meals. And most cities in the United States and even some small towns do this. So my advice would be to people who are mentally disabled or mentally ill and on disability need to find extra food is to call local churches or call the local charities, organizations, and see who gives out free food and or cooked meals in your area. It helps save money. And yes, I'm being a hypocrite because I'm an atheist. I may be an atheist, but I'm not stupid. Free food is free food, and it helps me balance my budget. So I guess that's all for now. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them below.